Hello, everyone. This is Tom Fox. Welcome to the Converge 20 podcast series, where we feature speakers and events from the upcoming Converge 20. Converge is in its fifth year of bringing together the world's leading companies for two days of dynamic speakers, thought-provoking breakout sessions, and opportunity to connect with the top like-minded compliance professionals literally across the globe. This year, the conference has gone virtual, but you will still leave the conference with new resources and best practices, allowing you to continue the hard work of driving ethics to the center of business. I link to the conversant registration in the show notes, so go ahead and register as it's at no charge. In this episode, I visit with Andy Hinton about issues relating to reporting in the era of COVID-19 and beyond. Hello, everyone. This is Tom Fox, back for another episode of Converge 20, where I'm uh, visiting with upcoming speakers at the event. And today I have with me Andy Hinton. Andy was, was I should say, the Chief Compliance Officer at Google, but he's off to new adventures now. So, Andy, maybe you could tell us a little bit about uh, what you're doing these days. Sure. Uh, I am, uh, in addition to spending much more time with my wife and kids, which is fantastic, I'm advising Hashtag Not Me, which is uh, uh, an app-based uh, uh, platform uh, that helps employers and employees uh, do a better job around issue spotting, issue identification, issue um, um, reporting, and ultimately risk management. Um, I, I do think it's the next generation of, of, of helplines, um, the next generation of, of, of concern response uh, management. In addition, I am going to be speaking at Diverge 20. Uh, super happy to do that. Um, not surprisingly doing a, doing, doing a session on whistleblower protection. And the, the session is going to be me interviewing a gentleman by the name of Ian Foxley. Ian, if you don't know, is the whistleblower. And, and one of the things that we're going to talk about is just the term whistleblower, but putting that aside, the whistleblower who, who set off the, the enforcement, um, um, action that ultimately resulted in Airbus paying almost four billion with a B dollars in penalties for corruption issues um, um, across the globe. Um, and it's just going to be a fascinating interview because Ian is a fascinating person. I don't want to give away too much, but his story involves uh, sneaking out of Saudi Arabia in the middle of the night. Um, and essentially all the things you, you don't want to do as an organization when you're, when you have the, the, uh, a person raising significant issues around misconduct. Uh, I've had the chance to interview Ian, and it is a harrowing story. Uh, oh. He is one of the <laughs> most courageous individuals I've come across, and I can't, frankly, cannot wait for uh, for your interview of him and and to really have you two talk about not only his story but how every compliance officer needs to understand the implications. So uh, I'm greatly looking forward to that. And if I could change the focus just a little bit to ask, what do you hope to get out of Converge Twenty? So, so I, I, as always, I, I hope to learn from 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 my peers, uh, especially regarding the the struggles that we're, we're we're dealing with as we deal with the the pandemic, as we deal with the increasing levels of of, of issues around social justice, uh, and how they impact the workplace. Um, the 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 a lot of folks don't think about innovation in the context of compliance, um, but but this whole dynamic and the uh, the, the urgencies that it's created has pushed us to be more innovative, to take on new technologies, uh, and to quite frankly do a better job around managing um, the risk the, the risk uh, portfolios of the organizations we're associated with. And so I'm hoping that Converge 20 will, will teach me new things. Well, Andy, I, for one, not only are looking forward to your presentation, but looking forward to with engaging with you at Converge 20. Oh, looking forward to it. Thank you so much, Tom. Hello, everyone. This is Tom Fox again. I hope you enjoyed this podcast about one of our Converge 20 speakers or Converge 20 events. I hope you will join me at this event. You can't beat the price. It's free. I've linked to, in the show notes, registration and information. This is going to be literally the best virtual compliance conference of the year. Can't beat the price. You'll be with the top compliance professionals around, and it will be an experience second to none. I hope you will plan to join me, and I look forward to visiting with you virtually at Converge 20.